For those of you that follow our channel, will know that Tina has a bit of a thing about the weather. So I bought her one of these. A five in one weather station. So I'm just gonna swap the bracket round so we can have it up on a flat surface. Up on that pole up there. It's gotta be facing north. We'll get all that done, get some batteries in it. Get it mounted on the pole. Oh, Tina will get it mounted on the pole. And uh, then we shall see how it goes. God help us, we'll know what the weather's doing all the time now. So that's the batteries in. Got to change the mount now. So here's a reminder to look at life that's pouring into you. So my friend, let me tell you once again, and you know that it's true. So that's the bracket mounted in that direction and we can get it up on a post now. So what we're going to do is just get a bit of plywood, mark out these holes on the plywood, get the plywood mounted on the post and... So there it is, all mounted. Cut it as level as we can. There's a little spirit bubble in the top of it and it needs to be pointing north or as north as you can get it. So now we're just waiting for the batteries to charge up for the the uh, the main display which you have indoors and then we can sync the two together and Tina will be laughing, she'll be able to tell us all the weather, what it's going to do and what it's not going to do. So this is the unit that sits inside and it connects wirelessly to the thing outside. It sets the time and date over radio. When we first set it up, it did it straight away, but the two weren't syncing together, so we had to resync them, and then it lost all its time and date. So we entered them manually, but now you can see that the little radio signal is on permanently, so that's connected to the radio. So we've got indoor temperature of 21.4, 51% humidity. This is the outdoor temperature, 9.7 and it's 80 percent this here's the wind so we've got an easterly wind and it's blowing at the moment at 10.8 kilometers an hour this down here is the wind chill factor so it feels like 8.6 this is all your barometric pressure which means absolutely nothing to me and this is a 12 hour forecast which i assume it works out through everything that it does rain let's press this button here Rainfall, zero millimetres, daily, 5.6, so does that include last night? Yeah, that's the last So, last, last 24 hours, we've had 5.6 mil of rain. Weekly, well, we've not had it for that long. Monthly, the same again. You have to press the wind button to get it back to the right. next button. Let's, so, let's press the wind button. No, the next button. That takes you back. There we go, barometric pressures and all that, it's all Irish. So, we won't worry about that. If you're interested in that, you can look it up on the internet. Do a Google search, like the rest of us. But yeah, there's a lot of other functions on it. And it seems to work quite well. We're number two on the Beaufort scale at the moment. Which I'm not sure what that means. Uh, light to moderate apparently according to the weather expert the in-house weather expert so there we have the Bressa 5-in-1 weather station so that uh, little gadget will definitely keep Tina happy being as she's the weather person in the house I don't know how many weather apps she's got on her iPad 
but uh, now she's got her own little weather station so she can tell us exactly what the weather's doing. All very good. So it was quite easy to set up, just had to get it level, get it pointing north. They sync together quite easily, it's all in the instructions. So, and keep your wife happy, buy one of those.